So tell me, when one thinks of scouting, what comes to mind? Boys, knots, bobber job, tents, woggles, something about dibs and dobs? Well, think again. Today, there are half a million scouts in the UK enjoying the fun, challenge and adventure of scouting, taking part in over 200 activities. It's not just putting up tents anymore. And that's boys and girls. That's right, girls. 60,000 of them and thousands of women volunteer with us. Scouting happens almost every night of the week in almost every community in the UK. Inner cities, tiny villages, large towns, small towns, any town your neighbourhood. It's quite likely that you're no more than a mile from your nearest group. Scouts come from all sorts of cultures, faiths and backgrounds, all walks of life. Actually, you're probably sitting pretty near someone who's been a scout. Just look for the one with the glint in their eye. Scouts get a great start in life. Take this lot. You guessed it, they were all scouts. Scouting gives young people confidence, passion, a spirit for adventure and, most importantly, a belief in themselves. And the skills they learn will help in adult life too. There's even badges for PR and IT. Every year, 10,000 of our Scouts travel to more than 150 countries to take part in community projects and expeditions. And talking of expeditions, you may have heard of our most famous volunteer. Hi, I'm Bear Grylls, Chief Scout. And in scouting, we believe all young people have the right to an adventure. This could be a beaver scout spending their first time away from home, or an explorer going on their first international expedition. But adventure is at the heart of what we do. But all of these adventures and opportunities are only possible with the help and support of our adult volunteers. Like Rich. Rich is a busy person, but luckily volunteers can give as much or as little time as they like. Being a scout leader is absolutely fantastic. It's great watching young people grow and try out activities. And of course, you get the opportunity to try out the activities yourself. Some things that most adults would never, ever try. And it's a brilliant topic of conversation for job interviews and people seem to be genuinely impressed. We love our volunteers and so do our scouts, like Lucy. Our leaders are really good. Um, we tell, tell them what sort of activities we'd like to do and they help us arrange them. Um, scouting is like the highlight of my week, it's a break from my schoolwork and home. So it's really good the leaders make it all happen. So, how could you help as a volunteer? Actually, quite easily. You don't just have to tie complex knots and you won't have to wear shorts. Well, you can if you want. If you can ride a bike, play a guitar, play a sport. Maybe you have management skills to offer or could help behind the scenes. Even if you can only spare an hour a month, you'll make a great volunteer. And how could volunteering help you? Well, you can get qualifications, learn new skills, explore the outdoors, have fun and help out your local community. All this looks brilliant on the CV too. Scouting is as popular as ever and it's growing at the fastest rate since the 1970s. 400,000 young people in the UK take part in the scouting adventure. But there are still 33,000 unable to join because we don't have enough volunteers. Any time you can give to your local scout group is truly amazing. And like me, you're going to find the experience exciting, challenging and definitely fulfilling. 